guys, today I'm going to do my haul from Colourpop Cosmetics. I bought some of their eyeshadows um, and their lippies, just two lippies, but it's mostly eyeshadows. This is the packaging that comes in. Very cute. Love these little packagings though. It kind of reminds me of MAC like eyeshadows. This is the personal um, letter or message that I got from the Colourpop company. I thought that was really, really cute. And there are two instructions for uh, one for lippies and one for the eyeshadows. It just um, tells you the tips and tricks on how to use the product on these cards. So that's a really nice touch to it. Let's get into the fun part, which is the eyeshadows. How many did I get? I don't even know. Hold on. They're only $5 a pot, so I went kind of cray cray on them and got a lot. One, the limited collection, like, kit set thing, and then others are all individual shadows, and then I bought two Lippies. Let's start with the limited collection, um, not a box of chocolates box, and it comes with six shades, and here it is. You get six shadows, beautiful. I think it's upside down. Like a sleeve, you just have to slide it open like that. Color, this is... The color called Halo. These shadows are kind of like cream or um, moussey texture. So you always have to really seal it tight after you finish using it. This is the color Halo. Beautiful gold kind of shade. It has flecks of gold. And then the next shade, which I'm really, really excited to use, is this purple shade right here. And here and this is the color called tinsel and um these are all called sh uh, super shock shadows by the way and let me swatch oh, oh my gosh this is so creamy that's crazy that's the color that's gorgeous it has um three dimensional glitters and it's just a it's like a purple shade muted purple shade with three dimensional glitters in here and you can apply this with a synthetic brush or you can apply it with your finger the next shade is called Partridge. oh yeah it re really 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 reminds me of the blue brown pigment from mac oh or the club eyeshadow from mac Oh my gosh, this is so gorge. That's crazy. And next, I have the color. Okay, I don't even know how to say this. Sel Selai? Seli? Oh no. Okay, this is like a moss green shade. It's so rich. Oh. They're so pretty. Can, can, I can't believe how pretty they are. Oh my gosh. This color is, um, yeah, moss green shade uh, with three dimensional glitters again. Very beautiful. I love that shade. Okay, I'm loving all of these colors so far. Well, maybe those three. This gold shade is okay. Next color is Drift. And this is the um, burgundy purple color. Now let me swatch. Oh, they're so creamy. Oh my gosh. That's so gorgeous. And make sure you seal it very tight. Next to that, Drift. Wait, yeah. So this is the color Drift. Oh my gosh. This is this one is more of um subtle sheen. It's not very glistening like the other colors, but it's still beautiful. And the last shade from this collection is I think it's matte. Let me check. To be accurate. Yeah, it's a matte shade. It's called a Doa Deer. This one is a plum shade. Beautiful plum rich eggplant 
shade. Gorgeous. I really love these three shades, which is called Tinsel, Partridge, and Slay. Yes, yeah, Slay. I think it's called Slay. All right, let's get into all the other shades that I've got from their single, like, individual shadows that they have on their website. So first color, I'm actually... No, I'm not wearing this. So first shade I got from their single eyeshadow line is the color called Bay. This is the color. Do you see the reflection? It's crazy. Um, this one is um, a duochrome finish. It has a flex of purple and blue shimmers. And this is a purple base color. Super unique, beautiful. I don't have anything like this. Next shade I'm actually wearing, it's called Fringe. I love the show called Fringe. I don't know if you guys watch that. But this is the color. Oh, isn't that beautiful? How metallic that looks and everything. It's just so gorgeous. And I'm actually wearing this on my center of my eyes, I think. So that's Fringe. Oops. I actually apply this with my finger first. I just pack the colors on. The I pack the color on my lid and then I blend it out with a synthetic brush. So that's the color Fringe. Love, love, love this shade. It's gorge. Uh, the next shade is called Empire. And this is a beautiful um, forest green shade. Oh, such a gorgeous. Oh my gosh, this is so soft, you guys. Ridiculous. <sighs> Oh my gosh, how is this possible? This is so gorgeous. Love this, love this green. Um, green looks really good on um, brown eyes, and I have brown eyes, so I'm super excited to use this. And next one is called Sequin. It's a beautiful, beautiful coppery shade, and it has um, flecks of glitters. Like, it's like micro glitters, it's not very chunky. But, oh, it's so beautiful. I can't believe how pretty they are. This one is called R I Heart This, or you can say I Love This, but I like to call it I Heart This. And this one, I'm actually wearing this too. This, this is the shit. Oh, isn't it beautiful? I'm wearing this on the outer corners of my eyes, right next to fringe. So that's... That's the color. It's like a muted champagne color. So gorgeous. It goes well with fringe. That's why I wanted to pair them together. Just show you side by side. So this is fringe and this is the color I heart this. So I really like these together. Next shade is called Get Lucky. This is a gold shade. Oh my gosh, pure liquid gold. It doesn't get better than this, you guys. Oh my gosh. This is so beautiful. This is not too metallic. This is more of a, a sheen than metallic, like shocking, shimmery color. It's really, really metallic on the on the finger though when you swatch it. But when you apply it on the skin, it looks more like a really beautiful sheen. Liberty. This is silver. Oh my gosh. They're so unbelievably pigmented. Oh my gosh. Guys, this is crazy. Okay. Liquid gold. Not gold. Liquid silver. Next color we're going to move on to is the color called Ibiza or Ibiza. So gorgeous. Very bright teal tur turquoise shade. Love it. All of the shadows have these imprints like snake prints on it and they are all beautiful. Color Dare. Oh, this is so soft. This is a beautiful purple. Oh, so that's Dare. And Dare has um, 
pink and purple flecks in the color. And the next shade is, this one is called Super Shock Press Pigment, and it's the color in Fantasy. Fantasy! This one is more um, on a pinky side purple. Magenta? Oh, gorgeous. I wouldn't say this is pink. I mean, purple, though. This is more like um, a pink than a purple. It looks like it's purple in here, but it's actually pink when you swatch it. Hot pink kind of shade. Next shade is called On the Rocks, and I've seen this on Desi Perkins, and oh, she looked amazing. Oh, oh my gosh, so pretty. This is... I don't know how to call this. This is like, um... Bronzy shade. I will just say coppery bronze shade. Flex of pink. And like multi-dimensional glitters in here. It's so gorgeous. It's unexpected that there's pink flecks of like micro glitters in there. Because you never see them paired together. So very unique shade. Super gorgeous. Love that one. Okay, so the next one is called Chipper. And this is um, a light green shade. So that's Chipper. This one is beautiful. It's not a color that I always reach for, reach for, but I wanted to have something that's different and um, colorful to um, have in my kit or my collection. I think this will go well, really well, with that color right there. Don't know what that is. Empire? I think it's an Empire, yeah. Empire and Chipper and Chipper is a light green shade with three-dimensional type of like micro glitters in there and then the last yeah the last shade is called Kimono I'm um, Japanese so kind of got excited about that name bluish purple shade Oh, love that kimono up there. Oh, so gorge. This will pair well with, yeah, Bay. Bay right next to it. Or you can pair it with Liberty. Like that right there with silver. Won't that be pretty? So that's kimono. And I got two lip shades so i got the color in cookie this is a shade it's beautiful i love this shade in the tube it kind of looks orange like yeah orangey nude shade but peachy nude or orangey nude but this is when you apply it on the skin it actually looks more like mauvey shade for some reason some people are mentioning about the scent of these lippies but it smells really good i think it smells like cake batter that's the cookie and this one is the matte finish love that one and then the next one is is by kathleen lights i think they collaborated together and came up with this color and um the color is called lumiere lumiere i hope i'm saying it right and this is the color that I'm actually wearing on my lips right now. So that's the shade. It's a little darker. It's definitely a mauve pink shade. Like, and it has like a purple undertone. I think it's amazing. Um, this shade really, really reminds me of Kylie Jenner. Like, that's the shade and it's gorgeous. This one is also matte finish. So I only got two matte finishes. We tend to um, like matte shades than shimmery or, you know, luster finish um, lipsticks. 